Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about insert into a statement in Oracle database. So about the insert into a statement, so it is used to insert a single record or multiple records in a table. So let's see my example. So currently I am going to use the table at your or EMP. So let's see the records by using select a star from EMP. So initially there are no any records and we have three or different columns id name and address now here after let's use insert statement so insert into so i'm going to insert into emp table and here let's give column name id here after name and here after address So let's copy that. Now here after ID name address and close by bracket here after let's give values. Uh, values and uh, here passing the value 116 or you can give triple one and here let's give the name mark and uh, here address going to give at your card. If you execute that one, oh, so one row inserted at here. Now let's see the record inside EMP table. So this is the record that I just inserted triple one mark and card it. So this the so this the way we can insert record one at one at a time. So if you wanna insert the records multiple times. So one time execute multiple record insert. So for this we have to use add here insert all statements. Now here after let's copy that this one. Paste it here. So this time going to insert at a three record one at a time. So at here I already used insert. Now uh, insert here not required. So let's remove insert and uh, after into EMP ID name address. Now let's give at a unique value one one two one one three one one four. Now let's give add here the name, name or Danny here address work and here address going to give Manchester and here next giving the address at here Manchester here after said name. Now let's uh, give add here the name. So going to give add here the name Max here. Rasa. So these three values going to enter one at a time in EMP table. Now let's use dummy table name. So from sorry, uh, select a star from dual so dual is the one dummy table now let's execute that so see at here three rows inserted so this is the way we can insert multiple records you can enter at here multiple record whatever you want so this the this so this is the way we can insert only one record one at a time and here one at a time you can insert multiple records so insert all we have we have to use and here this is the query we have to write now here after let's see uh, by using select a statement i'm going to insert the record so add here select a star from using employees table 
for employees table i'm going to use e m double e s okay This is the record inside employees table. So by using this employees table, I'm going to insert the record. So for this, we have to write insert a statement. So insert into. So I'm going to insert the record EMP table. Now here, let's pass ID. ID name address not going to write. Let's copy and paste it here. ID name address now here after let's close by bracket and from employees table going to select the columns right here we have to use select a statement so right here I'm using three columns so we have to specify only three columns at this point so employees em plo y double employee underscore id and over here Let's use first name and next. So going to give add a email. So add to address that receive email values. Email. Now here after let's use the table name. So I'm going to use P M P L O Y W E S employees. And here if you want in here you can use where clause. So to filter the record, so I'm going to filter the records if the salary is greater than five thousand. If the salary is greater than five thousand, then the record will load. So let's execute that. So see at the fifty-eight rows inserted. So if you want to check the record, select a star from EMP. So this is the record here, yeah, total sixty-two rows. See, so this is the records. So in address the value is no email value it's also inserted. So this is the name here. Yeah. So this is the way we can insert the record by another table here. Yeah. So we have to use this things select. So add here one more thing ID and here employee ID. So data type must be same name here. Yeah. So this is a string here yeah, a string address a string email a string. Then you can insert the record and number of columns must be same so if you are using add here three columns so you have to give three columns at this point also so by using select a statement we can also insert the records into oracle table so this is the things so this is the three ways and this three three important ways so this is a one at a time so one at one time many or rows and here this time if you want uh, to insert the others table record into a new table so you can also do that by using select a statement so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you